Hello, welcome back to Lee's Tech Room. And if you're new here, thanks for popping by. I really hope you enjoy what we've got on the show today. What we're looking at is the Ellie Baby Pro Plus. This is the baby camera and you've got the non-Wi-Fi monitor. Brilliant stuff. Uh, what we're going to do is going to do the unboxing and then we're going to see what it's like to set it up on the, on the app. And then we're going to see what it's like to use it. So what we're going to do, let's go and have a look what's inside the box right now. Okay, so this is the unboxing for the Ellie Baby Pro Plus all-in-one advanced AI monitor. So let's have a look on the um, top. We've got the um, baby monitor itself. Oh, so th there's the Baby Pro and then there's the monitor. We've got a crib holder, we've got a cushion, user manual, SD card, brilliant, and a power adapter. And on the back, let me just take the glasses off. Oh, 2K QHD, sleep tracking, two-way talk, danger zone detection, <laughs> lullabies, oh that's cool, um, auto photo capture, cry soothing, infrared night vision, cry detection, 360 pan and tilt, follow baby, oh, that's quite cool, uh, face covering and rollover alerts and temperature humidity sensor, hmm. excellent, so, okay so let's get it open and have a look inside and see what we've got in here, Do -do -do. Um, we're off, okay so nothing in the lid, we've got the manual, brilliant stuff, and um, just just get this out. That's actually smaller than I thought it was going to be, and lighter. Can we wrap her off? Can we? Got a little tail. It's cool. <laughs> and let's just rip this off. Uh, okay, so a little speaker on the front there. Nice sort of soft, plasticky feeling. Um, what have we got in here? There should be a USB, oh sorry, there's an SD card already in there, and that is a 32 gig. Okay, cool. And then there's the um, USB-C charger in there. Or oh, power even. Uh, okay, so let's put that down for a minute. And what have we got in here? This will be all the power cables, I imagine. So there's USB-C to A, which would be the power for that, I imagine. There's a soft cushion, helpful for going onto the crib holder, I believe. Um, stop baby from smashing their head on it. Uh, another USB-C to A, shorter one, which would be, well, there's a power socket. Um, I'm not sure what that one's for at the moment. There's a little clip, and there's the crib holder. This is the monitor here. Ah, okay. All right, let's leave that for a second. I'm just gonna see what else is on the box here. Oh, that's the, oh, let's get it out too. This is the, um, nothing else in the box. Oh, there's a, let's take that out. That's, uh, come back to that. I'm not sure exactly what that's for. There's a clip, there's the USB-A cable. And this is the crib holder, I think, so it extends. Uh, let's get this off. Oh no! <laughs> okay, I'll do that in a minute. So this uh, this goes onto the crib like that. This, the baby monitor goes on the top there, clips onto the top, and then uh, clips on somewhere, probably onto that. Yep, screws into there, into the bottom there, and then you can clamp it onto the crib wherever you want to, or cot if you will. So that's that. That's all the bits there. This is the interesting bit. Let's have a look at this monitor. Okay. Oh, it's pretty big. I mean, it's been scratched quite a lot, but that's the cover, so I can just take that off and like this. And now it's not scratched anymore. Ah, okay, it's like a really big mobile phone. <laughs> With... Oh, stand! Oh, look at that! Oh, it's come on. <laughs> Alright, looks like a good screen quality. Do we know what the screen quality is? It said um, 2K, didn't it? 2K QHD. Quad high definition for crisp video and zoom. Huh. 
Okay, so uh, I'm guessing it's not going to do anything at the moment because I haven't got anything connected. And, oh, camera's been disconnected. Well, it hasn't been connected at all yet. So what we do now is we're going to go and set it up and see what it's like. I'll see you in a second. Okay, so first of all, let's check out, let's get this connected to the app. And let's look at, after that, we'll have a look at the uh, no Wi-Fi monitor. Okay, so let's get the cable. And we need to plug it in. See, there's a port at the bottom there. There's a USB port, USB-C port. So we plug it in. There we go, plugged in. And then we just wait a few minutes and it will start doing its thing. Okay, so we've got a flashing red light. I'm going to hold that up to the camera. Hopefully you can see that there's a flashing red light in there. And then what we need to do then is we go to the app. I'll just take my glasses off because I can't see up close otherwise. And then we go to add device. So we go to add device. QR code error. Please check and rescan QR code. I haven't got to that point yet, but <laughs> give me a second, will you? Uh, so it's Ellie Baby Plus because it's got the monitor. Pro Plus and yes it's powered on for 15 seconds and the led light is flashing the led light is flashing and we connect to the wi-fi and so you can locate it to wherever you want to i'll just keep it as default because i'm only showing you what we need to do so far uh time zone is greenwich mean time that's for us so we've got a massively bright qr code there Holding up to the camera. It's hard to tell where you need to hold it. Connecting Wi-Fi. Ah, Please we go. wait for a minute. Please wait for a minute. So we'll hit next. And to see, we've got the AI features, which we'll go into in a minute. And you've got the um, virtual fence. Let's get started. So wait a second. Connection succeed. Connection succeed. And then if we swipe down, there we go. It's Please there. swipe down to refresh camera list. Yep, done that. Thank you. <laughs> so now we can enter. And we've got <laughs> a terrible picture of me. <laughs> so that's it. It's connected to the um, phone. So you can do lots and lots of different things on the app on the phone. But this video is all about this Wi-Fi monitor. So let's just quit out of that and put my phone down and then I'll show you the Wi-Fi monitor. Okay, so setting up the Wi-Fi monitor couldn't be easier. So you hit the power button and on it pops. Give it a second and we'll get in on the action. So you'll end up with a picture saying the camera's been disconnected. So you press this button here. There's the second one down. I don't know how to pronounce that. It's, it looks like it's got two screens on it. So you press that one and then you've got a new device. It's not touch screen. So then you have to press the menu button and it starts searching. So we're going to be searching for this um, monitor here. So it's come up with any baby press. A88 BO. <laughs> Uh, so we do that one, press the M button, which is the OK button, basically. It's the function button. Uh, connect into a new device. There we go. We're now we're transmitting data. And then we get connection successful. So we go OK. There we go. We're in. So you can, um, you can use the arrows to move it up and down, left and right. As you can see. <laughs> move it over there. Do you want to look at me? You can press the M button. Uh, I've got this plugged in. It's quite a small <laughs> cable. And press the M button there, which is the function button. brings up all the different options in the bottom there. So you've got the volume there. And um, you've got music, so you can play music if you want to. And then, and then this button here is the back button. So you press back. So we have a listen to some music. That's a nice effect. I like that. So let's just pause that. We don't want that one. Um, oh, press back. And then we go down to the um, zoom. So you can zoom in if you want to. Which is... Oh, up and down. 
up and down go zoom it zooms in pretty far and then we go back and we've got playback so you can play back all the different um please use the camera to scan the qr all the different videos yeah. that's on there so we just go back and we've got media which is there's the options to play the uh, videos on there already um so ai functions So as you know, it's a um, non-Wi-Fi screen which can support all the AI functions currently available on the market. And you can keep 100% privacy, as we know parents care about privacy, and some don't like Wi-Fi baby monitors, hence why we've got this one. It's a really, really good idea. Uh, the safety AI technologies are cry detection, face cover and rollover detection, breathing detection, virtual face detection, and sleep analysis. And you can use the cursor arrow to go over any which one that you want to try changing. Uh, so you go back and then you go to settings over here. And we've got lots of different settings here. So say a factory reset, look at the SD card and you can go to the camera settings as well. Okay, so when you finish that, you just press back and then you've got the um, icons on the bottom to so press back again. Then you've got the picture of the whole uh, video there. So you can take a picture if you want to and then you can press that button um, if you want to look for another one another camera then you can just go to new device and then go back you can press this button here that's so you can talk to the baby i'll just do it quickly because it's going to go crazy hello hello <laughs> so you can talk to them and you can just soothe them a little bit on the way back to the bedroom if you need to on the screen you've got the temperature and you've got the humidity you can see the AI is on and you can see the connectivity and the charge. If I unplug that, you can see how much charge is in there, which is not a lot. And you've got the time and date stamp at the top. So all in all, I think this is a brilliant camera, a brilliant camera monitor, especially for those of you who don't want to rely on a Wi-Fi network and you lose your privacy, don't you? Uh, this one is non-Wi-Fi, connects straight over to it and it's brilliant. You can pick it up, take it wherever you want to do, and you can put it into standby mode, which is what I just did. <laughs> and um, and you can stand it up, and it's still plugged in. Just press the button and off you go. If you have made it this far, then brilliant. Thanks very much, really appreciate it. And give my video a like, um, really helps me move forward and really helps my channel. If you want to, you can subscribe to my channel, but don't forget to ring that bell so you don't miss out on any future content. And if you have liked this video and you liked the features and you liked the uh, baby monitor, then you'll probably like this video as well. Check it out. See you later, bye.